Hey there, creative entrepreneurs. Welcome back to Seven Figure Rebel, where we are blazing a trail to financial freedom. Today, I want to show you how this simple to make digital product is making thousands of dollars on Etsy. What is it exactly? Digital paper. So let's dive right in. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more helpful content like this that will make you money. Okay, let's head over to Etsy, where I can show you an example of someone making more than $2,000 per month with just one digital product. I'm using a service called Everbee to see these stats. Everbee is a program that gives you an inside look at Etsy products. You'll be able to see how much they are selling, keywords to use, and more. If you'd like to try it out, I'll leave a link in the description. So let's look at this product right here. According to Everbee, it is making over $2,300 per month in revenue. Remember, profit is always lower than revenue, but since this is a digital product, it has hardly any overhead, so the profit margin is really good. There's nothing to ship. You create it once, and it can sell over and over again. And here's more good news. These digital papers are so simple to make when you use an AI tool called MidJourney. Let's head over there now. Okay, here we are in my mid-journey account. I'm going to type slash imagine and then type in my prompt, which is shabby chic pattern, tile. Be sure to add the two dashes with the word tile in order to make this pattern a seamless pattern. After you've done that, just hit the return key on your keyboard and wait a minute or so. Mid-journey will give you four separate images. From there, you can click on the U1, U2, U3, or U4 buttons to upgrade and save those, or click on the V1, V2, V3, or V4 buttons to get a new version. You can also hit the little circle arrows button to get a whole new four image output. See how easy that was? And they look great. To save a design after you've upgraded it, just click on the button that says Web. That will take you to your mid-journey gallery where you can click on the three dot button and then choose Save. Once you've saved all of your designs, Head over to canva.com. We'll choose an 8.5 by 11 inch canvas and then upload all of our files that we saved from Midjourney. Now, choose the image you want to work with. Drag and drop it onto the canvas and then we are going to put images together in order to create a seamless pattern. Just copy and paste, then move them where they need to be. Once you have everything in its place, you can save your image as a PNG high res file. I recommend saving it at 2550 by 3300 pixels. Here's a handy little guide to refer to when saving different sizes. Now you can just repeat this process for how many digital papers you want to include in your product bundle. Just keep having mid-journey design your image, save it, bring it over to Canva, tile it on your paper, and save it as a high-res PNG. You don't have to do 100, but the listing that we looked at earlier that was making over $2,300 per month had 100, so I'd say it might be worth your time. Now, once you are finished, you'll need to put all of the PNG files in a folder and zip to compress. You might even need to have more than one folder, depending on the amount of files. These will more than likely be too big to host on Etsy, which means you'll have to host them somewhere else. But not to worry. Let me show you what I do. Open a Google Doc and basically say thank you to the customer and tell them that they need to click on a link to access their files and give the link. Then save this document as a PDF file, which you will upload to Etsy on your product listing. Personally, I use a service called Sendowl to host my files, but you can always use Dropbox or another service. Let's look at creating a product image for Etsy showing our digital papers. Head back over to Canva and open up a 570 by 456 pixel design. I'm just going to take the designs and arrange them on the page and then give it a title. Obviously, you can take more time here and make it look as perfect as possible. This will be your main product image, so make a good impression. Once you have your main product image, you can make more images to show off more designs in your product bundle. You can create these in Canva as well. Now let's head over to ChatGPT and have AI write a product description for us. Of course, if you'd rather write it yourself, you certainly can. Here's what ChatGPT came up with. Go through and fill out all of your product listing info and there you have it. 
You'll have your digital product up on Etsy and making a passive income. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask in the comments. Be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on any more money-making content. Using the power of tools like ChatGPT and MidJourney, the possibilities are endless. See you on the next video.